I gotta teach Erica how to use this because last time there's a bunch of under and over exposed footage. So I usually dip it right under PPT. Because it's actually shooting in uh, S-Log 3. You're shooting in S-Log 3? I don't give a fuck about noise. We're going to Malibu. New Hi, guy. I'm Chris. I'm the new guy. I don't have an iPhone apparently. Yeah, yeah fired. Fired. <laughs> fired already. Totally fired. Our, our group chat's all green text now. <laughs> Worst. It's great. I just got over it with Jericho getting an iPhone. I've got to deal with it again, bro. Come on. <laughs> Boy, should I go get tested? Guys, this is Sam. I got you. This is Jericho. Hey, Chris. Hours and Jericho wants me to put this in the vlog, and it's not going to vlog because it's food and no one cares about food. Hey, I'm just giving you content. Hey, bro. Ham, I'm giving you content. Really? You desperately need content. Scouted locations. Actually, last week, how's the exposure first, Jericho? It's, it's, plus, it's plus 1.5. <laughs> so last week I came location scouting. Location scouting is the most important thing when you're doing commercial work because if you just show up on a location and you're not familiar with it, uh, your client's gonna doubt you, and your shots aren't gonna be as prepared, and you're gonna waste time, and your shots aren't gonna be as put together. So anyways, uh, I just brought Chris and Jericho here. Uh, we have our rep from the brand here, and uh, we're just walking through where we're gonna put clothes at, um, how we're gonna set it up, and then I shot Chris and Jericho just as stand-ins uh, to are the see pictures. what our shots will look like. No, you won't see those pictures. I don't want you guys to like un unsubscribe. Our last shoot, that Jericho was on. We didn't do a lot, of, a lot of behind the scenes just cause it's a very sporadic shoot. This shoot's a little more put together, so. And now there's two assistants, so. Hi, I'm two assistants. Actually, he's taking off for Jericho. I don't step on cameras either. Mm-hmm. This is, this is just the noon deal right here. <laughs> Not yet. But this is after day one, we're all pretty freaking tired. Well, I am at least. I don't know if you guys saw, but we went and styled a lot of the photo shoot today. There's like three different lines within this one brand. I'm not gonna mention the brand all that. Uh, last week we went location scouting, just getting an idea, and I were able to send that out to the brand and everyone on the on the brand team and everyone on our team, just so everyone gets an idea. And then today we went through everything and then we kind of paired up styling uh, wardrobe with which model will be in which spot. It's all very kind of complicated in this one though, because again, there's three different tiers and some models can't mix uh, depending on where the usage is gonna be. And some of the line will be in Europe too. So that kind of just complicates everything a little bit more. But thankfully our stylist is like, like a super hardcore pro. And so she was making it easy. We gotta be on location at six. So I'll be up at five. That's Cam, y'all. That's Cam. Whenever you make that type of... <laughs> I just hate that so much. It's terrifying. That's not even look. I named that character that I do. His name is Daquan. Every time I want to get... <laughs> I know what I'm saying, you feel me? <laughs> <laughs> Trying to go Long Beach. <laughs> you still have it though. We're crushing it so far. This location and these shots were supposed to be the hardest ones. So we got this over with and our rep for the brand said we covered a lot and she loves the shot so far. We weren't supposed to be tethering, but then she asked if we could tether. So we figured out how to connect the R5 to the iPad. And uh, she, that's one good thing about the Canon is like the colors look good straight on camera. I remember with the Sony, I would show creative directors the shots in the back of the camera and they'd be like, oh, and it was kind of stressful, but with the Canon, it honestly looks a thousand times better. And so she loves the shots already. This morning though, our light was coming over the mountain and lighting the whole backdrop, but the mall is wrong shade. So it's kind of a struggle to light them all. So we'll see how those turn out. That was a little bit stressful, but yeah, we're gonna have lunch and then we're on to the next location. Also, Jericho and Chris are crushing it. So that's right. Uh, Cam forgot his hard drives and computer that we backed everything up on. Uh, we went to look for the shots of what outfits we got yesterday, and he was like, oh, it's in the car, go get it. I looked in the car panicking, it's not in there. He left it outside of the Airbnb, so Scotty's gotta go get it. Oy. Congratulations to Scotty. Cam's fired. Cam's fired. Did you, did you tell him? I already told him what happened, and I told him that you fired you. Yeah, well, I didn't fire me. I'm still hired for life. Yeah. Fired. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. 
It happens. I mean, it's not necessary, but it's just it's not obviously necessary to have all the photos are on there. <laughs> <laughs> Alright y'all, this is the day after the campaign. I just unpacked the rental, I gotta go return that. Uh, long story short, I rented the RF 100 to 500. Uh, Lens Rental shifted out that night. It was supposed to be here by Friday. FedEx didn't get it to me till Monday. Uh, Lens Rental says they'll give me a full refund and for next time to contact them because they'll be able to contact FedEx to get it to me. So that was my bad, nothing on Lens Rentals. I love Lens Rentals. Good prices and all that but um yeah you can see versus the 70 to 200 the 100 to 400 is pretty big you got a thing what song is that that took forever i got it all on camera that was like a dumb and dumb fucking thing you guys know the Z cam. I sold this to Jericho, but this is his first time messing with the C70. Once again, you guys heard about this. He trampled this camera. <laughs> he ran over it. Do you think if you trampled this, this would have been okay? No. Exactly. That quick. This is our fourth day on this campaign. It's our final day. Final. Um, we're shooting some deep sea fishing. Uh, we probably won't be catching any actual fish though, because I guess it's slow. But did you show them our humble? Oh yeah. Uh, Traveler boat. Check I get out. I don't know any boat terms. This is a boat. It's a boat. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we should remake on the uh, island. I'm on a boat, bitch. I'm on a boat, bitch. Brought the Nanook just because it's waterproof and Jericho likes to break things, so. That's not true, but okay. Uh, we took sea sickness pills because we're flat landers. Mountain. We're not water folk. 